We left off of Reish Lamed Beis, second column, bottom paragraph. A madregozos shetitin a Torah l'odom. The level which a person is able to achieve through Torah, volam mein l'mabo. It has a semblance of the world to come. The hainu kamo Avram Yitzchok Yaakov shenoslem chayim shel tova v'shalva menucha. As we find Avram Yitzchok Yaakov. They had a good life, they had tranquility, and they had menucha. Re'afa Shabbos u'meinu l'mabo, k'mo sh'omru m'sachs b'v'basro. Gimel hitimon ba'olom hazeh me'in l'mabo. There are three people who already tasted the world to come in this world. Who are they? Avram Yitzchuk v'yakov. V'gam b'sha'at tzadikim efshalom ha'kach, d'ma shalomona, rak Avram Yitzchuk v'yakov. Ha'inu shitimon l'gamri b'chol dover. They had a full taste of it. To some degree, the tzaddik is able to have a taste of the world to come in this world. I mean, Shabbos, everybody has relevance to that. Shabbos is the main But he's saying through Torah, He's Tosis asks a question. Why does it only mention Avram Yitzchak Yaakov that they had a taste of the world to come in this world? Eov quotes a posuk. So Tosus answers the Eov lo hiyarak bechad milso. Only one aspect of his life. Avram Yitzchak Yaakov v'tim b'kol v'chol. Every aspect of Olam they already were able to taste in this world. Avol nirad lo kash to Avram Yitzchak Yaakov kach hoya god lo olam habo she hoya lohem. Achetimu mi osa chelik shoy lohem olam habo gila mi menu b'lo mazeh. They had such an enormous portion of the world to come that it was like an overflow in, into this world. Here this, he says, the Ovos, that Olam Abo was so great, it overflowed into this world. Eov, Hashem wanted him to have a sense of what Olam Abo was. I mean, the way he's saying, Eov has no share in the world to come. I mean, what he was in from the Hasidu was Olam. He says, not sure what he means. He says, Eov doesn't have a shimmer. He says, Lo shoyim olam habo shalom, Ajum lo hiili of olam habo. Kosev zeh shehevi hu revi, hu bein, gimel rishom shekulam, heim achayim olam hazeh, gimel achronim olam habo. The Mishnah quotes six psukim. Vaposka revi hazeh kamo dover shu kamo emtsoi, vein shneim, vormel brurim, o dufonech v'yishlov in dvorem eilu. Okay. Let's see the halacha. No, no, which means you're able to achieve to have a sense of feeling of what Olam, has, olam Habo is. It's a type of pleasure. It doesn't exist in this world. Right? I once, years ago, I once, we had, we had an insight. We learned in Gemara. So I said to the people, the level and people, they got excited about anything. Have you ever experienced anything like this in your life? Whatever it was. They said no. So it's a type of feeling that there's nothing comparable. There's nothing else. It can be replicated only within the context of Torah.